All right, guys, we're at another property. I'm not filming every single one, but skipping a couple of yards and just trying to give you guys some idea of some of the yards that we do. Uh, what a storm last night. Look, look at these trees back right here. What happened to it? And that was last night. That was all last night. But if you really want to see a tree that's split in half, or a big limb at least has, check this out. Look at this. Isn't that something? <clears throat> yeah, we had a serious storm last night here. So I will be contacting the owner and see if we can get this cleaned up for him. Not today, but some other day. Next week at least. And this is the back. Man. That is something. Luckily it didn't hit this house. But the way it split, that tree's probably gonna die now. So if I was him, I'd take this whole thing down, which we can do as well. We do tree service as well, guys. Um, I have a different crew that just does trees, big trees, any size trees, really. Uh, so I'm currently with the mowing crew. And uh, <coughs> so I will be letting him know and Hopefully we can take care of that for him. But yeah, I would, when I see something like that, I uh, I would recommend the whole tree to go down because it's gonna die and it can either fall on the house if another good wind comes through or who knows, so. But yeah, I figure I'd show you guys another yard. It's probably gonna be the last one of the day. Um, like I said, I'm still figuring out YouTube, so I haven't figured out how to pause the video and then continue at least not on my phone probably not an option i may have to get a actual camcorder but uh instead of you know making little clips a minute here and a minute there i'd like to just pause it and when we pull up in the next yard you know continue on so maybe it's something to look into and invest in a nice little camcorder but I gotta show you guys this is another yard. All the yards are scruffy looking, man. I mean, this is, they're all new, you know, sun's out, season's in here, coming in. And so, <coughs> but we make them look good, we'll clean them up. This one right here is a bi weekly. Saving Green uh, Lawn Care, I started it back in 2009. So I've been in business uh, eight years. This is my ninth year, ninth season. And uh, let me get in here all this mowing. This is my ninth year, ninth season. And so far so good. And we do an average uh, 120 plus a week uh, starting pretty much in April and then we keep that number you know it fluctuates of course some weeks maybe a little less some weeks a little more depending also on the weather but we hold that through uh, through November and December um, and then January and February as I mentioned in my uh, description we are the slowest in those two months still not dead we have plenty to do but uh, definitely the mowing at least has uh, comes to a halt and then uh, we do other things 
as I mentioned in my other video. So, but uh, anyway, and I will be making a video when I get a chance and <coughs> of all the equipment that I have. That right there is the Skag 48 inch walk behind. I do own two of those. Uh, I have a Hustler 2011 X1, uh, and I do have a uh, 2016 uh, fuel injected, fuel injected liquid cooled uh, Turf Tiger 2, second edition one. So that was a real exciting purchase for me, and the mower is fantastic. So, um, oh, and I just picked up about two weeks ago, I guess. Uh, the Skag 36 inch V-Ride. We got a couple of townhomes and a couple of other areas where the backyards are super small and we just got pretty much last year got tired of uh, got tired of uh, weed eating and push mowing so I ended up just making that decision to get a 36 inch stand on and that way we can smoothly uh, go through even those things so Say something to the fans. Saving green today. <laughs> saving green today. Hola. Are we saving Hola. green to people today or are we cutting green? Or, uh, cut green and saving. And, and green saving. Green. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll talk to you later. See ya.